What is up guys? Welcome back to Awesome Kids TV. Welcome to video. Welcome back to AKT Racers. This is video number seven of AKT Racers series. We are back yet again for another super awesome creation to add to this beautiful land. That's right, we're making a little pond over here, but we're also making a special craft. I would like to introduce to you the digital dragster. As you can see, this character has a digital arm clock on the back and a uh, fold out uh, bumper, front, fold out front bumper, so that the racer itself can either cruise on the street with the bumper down or go through loops with the, with the bumper up. Anyway, the uh, essentials we need for the pond are water, obviously, gravel and or puzzle, we're going to use both for win-win, and of course we're going to be adding a couple of the oak and spruce trees into the build. I'll just get the bow meal. Now we shall begin to build this uh, pond. We will start with the gravel and uh, puzzle uh, at the bottom and then work our way to the top. Um, this is going to look pretty good. I did watch one of my favorite TV shows, LPS, before all this. Uh, it is leaving uh, to be uh, soon, so we gotta uh, watch all the way to the end and like make sure that we have the best adventure of our lives. Okay, we start with the gravel in the pond, and then we go to puzzle. We switch the puzzle. Uh, we start with that's right, guys. We start with a gravel layer. Then go to puzzle and uh, um, continue from there. The TNT explosions I made last time really made a change to um, uh, this area right over here as well as the other areas of the land. <laughs> Anyway, we don't have time to uh, chat about that. We don't have time. We have time to make this pond. The pond is looking pretty nice. We just need to edit all of this. And luckily my world editing skills have come in handy. We'll edit this over here edit this i forgot to edit this so i'm very sorry about that but besides that we are getting this done pretty quickly with the gravel and the puzzle layers so we're uh gonna be um be very good all right guys we're almost done once we are complete the pond we are going to add of course all the water and the fish all right we are now ready to add the water so let's add all the water there we go this pond is looking kawaii beautiful with all the water that we are using to it, of course. Does that look strained out? Yeah, it does. It does. All right, let's move on to the final layer. We're working on the final layer now. The final layer of water is bigger than all the other layers, of course, so that's why we do that one last. Now it is time to put in the final detail of this entire project. And that, my friends, is the fish. So we're gonna put the fish 
into the pond. Okay, we got our dispenser. We're ready, but first we need to wall up this section so that it doesn't get uh, destroyed by all the creatures who are currently living here. There we go. This wall, if you don't know, basically protects all the creatures from the woodland, uh, the witches' spells and wood trolls and stuff. That just made me think of face of herb. Speaking of that, if you were a lot like Alex Clark, uh, back when you were a lot younger, then oh boy, can you possibly relate? Anyway, one time, Alex Clark and his mom, uh, went to a Mexican restaurant and no, it was not a Taco Bell, it was a Wendy's. That's right, you heard me. Super authentic, yummy tasting Mexican Wendy's. And when Alex Clark was little, they had a all-you-could-eat ta taco bar. And he literally plowed through 40 tacos in a span of 20 minutes. <laughs> And it was so much food that the manager came out and he was so like, You have been eating too much tacos. Is, is it just me or whenever you hear someone say something like that, you just eat more tacos? Well, long story short, as they were walking out to the parking lot, Alex Clark... Uh, realized that the manager was really right and based on the title of the video you probably think of what's gonna happen well it's not Alex Clark literally threw up oh man I tricked ya but when they came home he and his mom rushed straight into the bathroom they legit rushed into the bathroom and Alex Clark at the time didn't want to tell you what would happen in there because she would uh, kill him. But at the end, she got M&M's. And now you know why Wendy does not have a taco bar anymore. Because when Alex Clark was little, he literally plowed through 40 tacos in to one frickin' minutes. Yeah, that's right. He plowed through 40 tacos in 20 minutes. When he was a uh, little. And he threw up. Literally threw up in front of his mother. And that's why he never did that again. He never did that. He never did all that again. Anyway, enough chitter chatter about one of my favorite YouTubers. We are gonna get a couple fish in there. Salmon, clownfish, pufferfish. Um, what else? Regular fish. Are those all the fish in the game? Yep. Those are all the fish in the game. Now, nah, holy moly, look at how many stacks of, look at how many stacks of buckets we got. Holy cow, man. Holy freaking cow. That is insanity right there. There you go, all the fish are now in the dispenser including the puffer fish we can now go and uh press i mean we can now go ahead and put them into the uh pond actually this is taking too long 
We need a faster system. Luckily, I came up with a faster system. There we go. So the basic idea is that the minecart rolls around this track and whenever it does that it like spawns all the fish. It spawns all the fish into the environment. Into the uh, pond a lot faster. And we can like fish for them. It'll be like actual real life fishing, but better. Now we just get a minecart. I'll go for the regular one. Now we push the minecart along. No, that also takes too long. We need to upgrade the track. We need to upgrade this. Okay, this is much better. Extend the track and then uh, do this. That's also taking too long. We need to extend even further. We need to extend even further so that the my car would gain less speed there we go much better while that my car is doing that we will now go all the way back to the creature paradise and uh um store away all that cargo now where is that cargo station where did i put it hmm the forest stuff legends Wait a minute, this is the Forest of Legends. There's no cargo service here. Whoops. Only that creature paradise has it. <laughs> yes, I did create that once. Okay, this is where the cargo uh, loading station is. Okay, where's that minecart? Where is that minecart? Ah, uh, right here. Now we just send the minecart to here. Actually, switch track. Go over to there. There you go. We unload our extra stuff, our extra items that we don't need. We load them in to this chest, minecart chest, and then we take it all away. Now we switch the railroad back over to the chest area.
There we go. All of the items are now being dropped off. Now we shall, and now, and now we return. Now we return to the location we were in earlier. And see if that dispenser is done dispensing. Oh wow, it's still dispensing. Okay, that is taking forever. There we go. This is much faster. This is so much faster. taking forever to let's upgrade to a more fast way to do this I know what we can do Peter. This is a better solution. Now we just turn her turn her on. That is much faster. It saves us a lot of time. We should have used this in the beginning. <laughs> now we can go fishing. All right, that's enough fish dispensing. We don't need this contraption anymore. Now we shall check up on that chat, uh, my car chest to, uh, you know, see if it's all right. And oh boy, that is a ton of fish. All right, let's do some uh, uh, fishing. Let me grab my fishing rod. I got one! Wait until I get another one. Oops. Maybe if I fly, I'll get a better chance. Ah, uh, this is taking too long. Alright, I fished for all the fish in the pond. Now we shall return to that cargo area. 
and unload all the fish I have gotten along with the redstone stuff I got. And uh, we're here. There's the chest, my car chest. It's still unloading everything. Okay, I'll just give you more items to unload. There we go. A couple more items. All right, everyone, that's going to be it for this uh, uh, episode. That, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Don't forget to stay tuned for future videos. Bye-bye.